Well, its value is more than many people's homes. A $115,000 Cadillac vanishes, taken right off a car lot in Brentwood. News Channel 5's Aaron Kentrell found out this was a well thought out crime. Atif Boustros, the owner of A&H Auto Repair on Murfreesboro Pike, will tell you he has some of the most loyal customers. They're the reason he was able to retrieve his stolen tow truck. This one. When Bustros picked it up Tuesday morning, it had about $2,000 worth of damage to it. When he got back to watch surveillance video with police, he realized why it was so badly damaged. Cameras showed two people breaking into the tow truck around 1.30 that morning, catching them for about 15 minutes. During this time, they break the ignition switch. You know, like professional. It's professional people. He know how to use the truck truck. And the passenger looks straight into the camera. Eventually, they take off. The thieves didn't waste much time once they stole that tow truck. They took about a 20 minute drive down here to Brentwood here at Andrews Cadillac, and that's where they loaded up a car. Their cameras caught the stolen tow truck being used to take a Cadillac CTF Blackwing out of Andrews Cadillac's parking lot. Bouchos discovered his tow truck was used in the car theft when employees from Andrews Cadillac showed up to his business. You know, I show him the video, I show him the two people, actually the one he broke the glass and he stole the truck. And he take the video and he go. Bouchos is grateful he was able to recover his truck. I have to move like broken car from here to the back, back to the front. Imagine if I didn't have tow truck. As for the $115,000 car stolen, well, there's no sign of it. Bustos already has 16 cameras up and hopes this never happens again. We need at least cobbles night time in this business here because this location, this area, it's not, it's not safety. It's bad area, actually. Reporting for News Channel 5, I'm Aaron Kentrell. Thank you, Aaron. Both uh, Brentwood Police and Metro PD involved in this investigation. So if you might recognize the people in the video or have some information, you can call either department.